Right. So it's this. In a well-run clinic, you can say that approximately, in studies, at least 80% improve. But you remember in studies, if someone leaves town or is non-compliant, does not return, yeah. it's a failure. Uh -huh. But in actuality, in a daily practice, you can say that from 10 patients that did not receive relief for any other form of treatment, nine of those will benefit significantly from PST. And of those nine, after two and a half years, at least seven will still have the benefit. In the joint space, if it's too narrow, there's no cartilage. Uh, in a case like that, a knee with a heavy arthrosis that I would usually put a, 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 a prosthesis, a knee arthroplasty. Does, does it help to? Uh, but not as much, no? Let me tell you, it's an interesting point, very interesting. Uh, I did these studies with Alfred J. Bullitt, who was the chairman of the National Subspecialty Board of Rheumatology and the chief medical officer at Yale, and he and I uh, found a common interest in basic research in osteoarthritis. And he and I both thought that grade four is what you're talking about, uh -huh. level four, one, two, three, and four, would not respond as well. However, we found, percentage-wise, they responded better or as well as the grade two and grade three. Probably the reason being, you don't need a lot of cartilage. In fact, you don't need any cartilage no, no kidding. to stimulate the growth and repair of cartilage. You need chondrocytes. You need the precursors to cartilage, the cells that develop into cartilage. But the chondrocytes are in the bone or inside the, the cartilage? The chondrocytes are in the extracellular matrix and are waiting to be stimulated. The chondrocytes are part of a presentation that we just completed where we showed the ionic exchange, which is the very basic biophysical level, and then the biochemical expression of that ionic exchange, and then the integration of the biochemical process into a cytoskeletal matrix or expression diagrammatically, and then ex that's all expressed in lineages. While that sounds somewhat complicated, the simple answer is as long as the patient is alive and has chondrocytes, which everyone does, there is a possibility to help with uh, PST because most orthopedic surgeons w might say that the joint is bald, that it but no longer has no cartilage. no cartilage. What they really mean though, if you were to look into that joint, is it has a defect, a cartilage defect. What we did, we did MRI studies before PST and after PST in over 100 patients to visually image what was going on. And you can actually see that this defect is repaired. I so see. it is, so in proven. fact, um, effective. however, the best patients to treat are grade two and three because they have fewer other problems. No, yes, that's for sure. But, but, it's, but it's a relief mainly for those people who are, who are not in clinical conditions, let's say, to, to, to undergo a, 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 a joint replacement, can benefit from PST instead of taking anti-inflammatory drugs mm -hmm. a lot. Right. Uh, right. The very first patient... Nephrotoxic and whatever. Nephrotoxic uh, yes. and um, hepatotoxic and all of the other problems that we... The question in rheumatology is uh, when a new drug, is it hepatotoxic or nephrotoxic? No one says is it toxic or not. Of course it's toxic. Uh, the most interesting aspect is we did a uh, large study when uh, Professor Nick Bellamy was in charge of the London uh, orthopedic clinic in London, Ontario, Canada, he had 10,000 patients waiting to receive new hips or hip joint replacement. And when I asked him to study some of them, he said, you can have 1,000. They're all waiting online anyway. Uh, and in fact, we said if more than 10% didn't go on to surgery, 
it would be a good outcome. But in fact, there were 56% decided or did, did not go to surgery. No kidding. No. And of the remaining 44%, about half of them, it was interesting, said they're going to surgery for one of two reasons. Because if it does, if PST doesn't last a long time, they don't want to get back on the list. On the list. <laughs> or understand. they said they don't want to disappoint their doctors, so they're going to to be sure. To be sure that yeah. that it will.